When you wake up in the morning and you look at yourself in the mirror, do you smile? Maybe you have a wink, maybe an I love you just the way you are. Or do you notice those wrinkles on your forehead, the dark circles under your eyes? Do you say, oh, I really need to lose that extra five pounds? Hi, I'm Ellie Beerman, and I'm really glad you came by here today. You can find me at How to Be Happy with AllieB.com. So, what is it that causes you to feel one way or the other? Well, last week we were talking about accurate thinking. So today we're talking about accurate thinking as it appears in your life. A lot of people say, yeah, I'm happy. Yeah, I love myself. But then they'll do something, like look in the mirror and look for what's wrong instead of what they really find attractive about who they are and how they are right now. And it's not because they created these programs. It's because people in your early, early life fed that information into you when you were too young to keep it out. So there are these file folders deep in your subconscious mind and all your life long, these new documents, evidence going in to these folders, to these folders, to these folders about you're being overweight or maybe you're being too slow or maybe you're too smart. All these bad things go in and creating your self-image. And the thing is, your self-image is determining who you can and cannot be, what you can and cannot do, and therefore what you can and cannot have. It's not that hard to change. I'm going to show you how next week. So I look forward to seeing you back here, same time, same place. And if you haven't done so already, go ahead over there, get your copy of my free gift that I have for you. And also, I really appreciate your clicking like and share. Because everybody's walking around feeling down on themselves, even when they wear one of those pretend smiles. Take a good look. Because there's a difference between a <laughs> there's a difference between a pretend smile and an honest to goodness from your heart smile. It's about an eighth of an inch, and boy, is it noticeable. Enjoy a wonderful week. I will see you back here next week.